Hey everyone, just wanted to talk a little bit about the golf swing and the elements that help me hit good golf shots and I believe that can help you guys hit some good golf shots. So first things first, we'll start with setup. So some of the key elements that I look for here is uh, having front bend and enough front bend that your knees don't go past the balls of your feet and that my shoulders are about on my toes to just outside my toes, okay? And then wherever my arms hang from there is where you grip the golf club which should be about a hitchhiker thumb away from the butt end of the club, okay? Pressure feels like it's about 60% on the balls of my feet, okay? As I take the club back, I really just make sure I look for, it feels like I'm almost like pushing the club a little bit away from me. This helps me with width, and I try to keep the club face with my spine at hands waist high to the ground, or waist high, waist high, okay? Then from here, I just try to turn it up, and this pretty much gets you in a pretty good position if you just feel like you just turn it up kind of thing. And as I come down, I feel like as I'm rotating, it feels like this side pulls the club. So my club face is back square to the same exact angle as it was when I was taking on my backswing, okay? So as this side feels like it rotates and pulls, it pulls my elbow in front of my right hip, okay, which I like to see. And then the club can come into the ground, into the ball area with shaft lean, so the, the handle is just in front of the club. The club face dictates on your ball start line and your path dictates on how much it curves. So that we're not worrying about. We're just going, as I'm pulling and rotating, it feels like my left shoulder goes almost over my left part of my foot on my left side and then rotates open, okay? So then it just rotates behind me and I feel like everything kind of turns, turns together and balanced to my target, okay? so. A lot of the elements here are really simple. I try to keep it as simple as I can. And on the downswing, in the transition, I want the club square. So the club basically didn't manipulate very much in the backswing. I feel like I push it, it stays, in my club. it stays in my spine angle. So as I'm getting to the top, as I've already turned it up, it's already square. That's what keeps the club square on the way down. I don't have to manipulate the club. It doesn't have to you know, go open or go more close or anything like that. It just stays in the same position. And I just feel like I pull and rotate together with my left shoulder, with my left side, just keep rotating to my target. And then I just really make sure I'm balanced and everything finishing towards my target with my belly button and everything. And that's really important because then you can see if you went too much to your balls or too much to your heels, you know? So all those things matter on balance and a good finish. Helps you dictate and see where you missed the shot and why. Uh, so the elements we went over, you know, is the setup, the backswing, and the downswing. Just some check marks that you look for and how to hit some really good golf shots.